welcome back to our channel! We are so happy to see you here today and so glad that you would join us again. Before we start, we want everybody to know in the in the east that is being hit by Florence, the, the hurricane, they, they, we, our hearts go out to you. I totally. Hope that, I hope you've taken your stitching and put it way up high so that it doesn't get flooded out. I, Gosh, it turned out to not be such a horrible storm, but just lots of flooding. Totally. So we feel our, our, our hearts go out to yeah, you. Yeah, that would be crazy. And we, and we don't really ever have to experience things like that. Yeah, we do get really bad winds here. That's true. We get really bad winds, but it's just wind. Yeah. If it's in the winter, it's kind of crazy with snow fl flying and stuff, but it's not like a hurricane. No. You know what I mean? But anyway, you guys, good luck. I hope Someone everything... was saying that they got hit by like a, a category like five tornado. And that's my biggest oh, fear. I yeah. do not like tornadoes. They yeah, scare no, the Kef doesn't. Out of me. Yeah, that's a scary. I, I, I sort of think they're cool. I would, I, you know. But anyway, but I, I, you know, I. They're don't, not cool. I know, I know. But I just there's something about them that just. It is. It, it's like fascinating. Yeah, it's intriguing. If I could watch it from a distance, I would love to. But yeah, and we had one here. We did. And and do, and you were here. I'll you were, never forget the day. And, I and, thought we were all gonna die. And it was. Uh, it I was want to nuts. say it was like it was summer. Two thousand? No, it was beyond. It was, I think, beyond that. Oh, I can't remember. Like later? You? Well, we, yeah, be before. Two, it was after two thousand. I remember all of the pains came over. Yes, here. and st and stayed here at the house. It was horrible. And then and then we, it didn't even come near us. No, it didn't. But the sky. Got it was so, so freaky. It was freaky. I was and, outside. I'm like, I don't think I should be outside right and now. And then Matt and I went to fill it, fill vending machines. Do you remember? You that? did that yeah, day, yeah. same day. And we were driving. We were going to Ogden, and we looked back this way. It was crazy. It That's really weird. Went, that was. It was weird. We all went to the basement, you know, as if we were going to die. Yeah, as if. <laughs> and some people's houses were. You know, yeah, definitely. But it was not, I mean, not It hit anymore. like downtown Salt Lake. Yeah, it was literally downtown Salt Lake. And I feel like I screwed up everybody last week. Did you see these comments? No. I was wearing a Rockies t-shirt. <gasps> oh, I did like, see Like not those. even thinking. Oh! Like literally I had no idea if that even meant that it was in Colorado. Oh, so somebody thought we were in Colorado. So people thought that we live in Colorado, but we do not live in Colorado. Oh, yeah, we're not. We're in Salt Lake City, Utah. Yeah. Oh, that's. I did see. People it was kind of like it. a bad week for me to wear that and then be like, "We, Debbie's gonna have a cross stitching party at oh, our house." Oh, yes. I'm sorry. Oh, that's funny. So we live in Salt Lake. Well, yeah. we live like 20 minutes away from Salt Lake City. But anyway, that's okay. So anyway, good luck to all of you that are going through this weather. Yes. Um, we, we wish you the very best. Totally. Um, and so um, good luck. Yes. All right. We um, we want to give some a, a couple of shout outs. Well, we should talk about uh, these things that we were that we were given first. Okay. Oh, yes, yes. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. So Kay, our dear friend. We love her um, to death. And Floss, uh, Floss Tube Watcher, she uh, went to Disneyland. We're and she, very jealous. And we're, we were so jealous and she brought us back Mickey Suckers. I know, I was going to actually open one and... And eat it while we were... Okay. <laughs> So anyway, Mickey so Suckers. Thank you, Kay. We love you. We appreciate that so much. And Kath. Oh, wait, you... wait, wait. Before. Oh, okay. Speaking right. of Disney. Okay. Oh, okay. The Mary Poppins trailer came out today. Okay. And did you watch it? I am very impressed by it. Oh, really? Yes. I haven't seen it yet, so I'll it's have to watch it. very good. Oh. I want to say it's like two and a half minutes long. And wow. Who's Mary? Emily Blunt. Oh, Emily Blunt. I was kind of right. like, oh, will she be a good Mary Poppins? And she just nails it. Oh. Colin Firth is in it. <gasps> oh, my. Meryl Streep, I want to no. say. Really? I mean, you guys. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. Wow. And then my good friend who lives in New York, Madeline. She's going to be here when it comes out, so we're going to go see it together. Oh, that's so fun. Okay, and Dick Van Dyke was supposed to be here. Speaking of Bert. 
you know, in oh, Mary no, Poppins. Well, did he not come? He didn't come. So he was coming to Comic Con. And so Dave was going to get his picture. He oh, wasn't going to do think about anybody that. else. And he thought Dick Van Dyke felt like it was just like. Worth it. Yeah, kind of an icon. So he signed up to get his picture with Dick Van Dyke. And then he didn't come. I wonder if he was sick or got, Maybe. you know, not feeling well. Yeah. So then he didn't come. So anyway, so he was going to get his picture with Dick Van Dyke. We love Mary Poppins. Yeah. Oh, I love it. It's so it's it's like one of my all-time favorites. It's so So great. it makes me nervous when they do like yeah, a new one. Yeah, I know, I know. But, oh man, I think it's going to be good. Okay, that's exciting. So that's exciting. And 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 Kay actually loves Mary Poppins. Oh, does she? Yeah, yeah. I yeah. didn't and I, know that. I told her she needed to get her picture. Remember? Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, oh, so that looks yeah. so good. Okay, all right. Okay. So now back to the big deal. The big deal. <laughs> there it is. I'll, I'll bring it out for you. Steph sent us the cutest card ever. Um, why can't I think of what is it? Wendy? No. What, what do you think? Oh, it's Dorothy. Dorothy. Dorothy and her tornado. Yes, she does have tornadoes. Yes, yeah, yeah. And the cutest no ever. Yeah, it was really And cute. she was just so nice to me this week on Instagram. Yeah. She sent me all sorts of nice things. So thank you, Steph. And then she sent us the Mecca <laughs> of glittery floss. And it's everyone. beautiful. It is so beautiful. And, and now since, I don't even want to use it. It's so beautiful. Now since she has sent this, I recognize it as um, needlepoint. Did I tell you this? No. If you go, if I go to the Needlepoint store, we can get this. We can buy that here. You, do you see what I'm saying? Oh. Yeah. So uh, when I Needlepoint, I've used this kind. It's thicker. It's definitely thicker. It's not that, but you could get thinner. Oh, because it says Needlepoint. Yeah. Yeah. And so after you showed it to me, but that is beautiful. It is so pretty and so soft. Yeah, it is. It's gorgeous. It, it's just, I don't know why I didn't think of it. And I freaking love this purple one. It's amazing. It it's is. magical. It is. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Yeah. Steph, I owe you my whole life. That is so cool. So we got those. Don't just keep stitching. Yes. If you're living under a rock. That's right. <laughs> okay, so, so Steph, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so excited to use them this week. Yeah, that'll be really fun. I'm very excited. Okay, and then I sent Penny McCabe um, from Maine. Oh, um, we love Maine. She actually was interested in one of the blocks, and I sent her one of the blocks from the uh, cro uh, Cross Stitch and cre uh, Craft Center of Fine Stitchery. Craft Center of Fine Stitchery. And I told her, you know, I mean, it was no big deal. It was just, I just did it, blah, blah, blah. And she sent us back. These two patterns. Which I'm dead on the floor with. I mean, this one is just really fun. It is so beautiful. So it's from a chalk on the home, chalk for the home, let it snow bungalow. And, and we what, love our chalk drawings. And wouldn't it be pretty with, with those the sparkles? Yeah, with that. I I think we, you would do it the blue. I think we oh find Oh my a, gosh. Wouldn't it be pretty? It's the best thing I've ever seen. I think it's gorgeous. So she sent us that. We, that is from Hands On Design. We love that. Both of us. It's and, so cute. And I love all of the, you know, country, country cottage. Country cottage needleworks. It's so darling. And I think you ought to do that one because it's got the little dog. I know. You know, that you yes. could do Harleen. Yes. So anyway, she, it was so sweet of her. Penny, Penny, you did not have to do that. Yeah, no, thank we you. We freaking love you. Yes, yeah, so that was really Next sweet. Next time in, I'm in Maine, I expect to see you. That's right. Yeah, yeah. So, we love Maine. Yeah, so that was really fun. So we wanted to show you those things. That was that was a lot of fun. Totally. So anyway, and we love the, the um, chalk, chalk one. That's chalk so one's cute. so cute. I don't know. We, I have not cross-stitched on black. I, you know, I know that'll be interesting because some people really struggle with it. Their eyes and, you know, focusing anyway. That means I'll really struggle. But we'll get, we'll get. But there was a cute small one. Oh yeah. Just the top. Oh, just the winter. That's what I like. Yeah. So. And I can see it in the white sparkle and the blue sparkle. Oh my heck. I think it'd be really cute. Okay. Prepare yourselves. Okay. All right. So that's darling. You guys, let's discuss. Debbie's cross stitching stitch in party. A stitch in a, th a word? I don't know. Or, or maybe, maybe I'll just make that maybe up. Maybe I just made it up. I don't know. 
Okay. Everybody said in the comments, like, oh, a stitch in with you would be amazing. Okay. Here's the deal. We're going to do a YouTube live stream when it happens. Okay. Because everybody begged us for it. Okay, we, we will do that. And we'll give you a tour of Debbie's house with all oh. her decorations. Oh, because I will have my Halloween out. That's true. That's true. Okay. So we've decided. I have a couple of days off here in Utah. They call it fall break. So we're going to do it on October the 20th. Saturday, October the 20th. We didn't really discuss the time. Like, should we do like 1 o'clock to... Uh, uh, Is that better? Uh, I, yeah, I, that would give people time to get here if they were coming from That's Idaho true. or something. So what if we did one o'clock till like seven or something? That's great. And then we can or you even can stay until ten. Or you could stay till ten. We could send out for pizza like that they do at at, at the the shop at um, Keepsakes. Yeah. We'll do something like that. And and we will do it on the 20th of October. That's a Saturday. In Farmington, Utah. We'll give you our address. We will. From one o'clock till seven. One to seven people. Okay. And we'll we'll have little surprises. Many surprises will be given. Okay. All right. And then we will just, we literally, we're just going to sit and stitch. That's all. That's all. Okay. And so all of you can be there too because it'll be on YouTube live streaming. Okay. I've never right. done that before. But. Okay. This will be interesting. So yeah. So that's, we've decided to do that. We hope that works with your schedule. Yes. Let us know if it doesn't. Yeah. We, we. Because if none of you can come, then we don't want to do we it. We won't do it. Yeah, but we um, we were kind of debating over the very first, the sixth of October. Yeah, but we feel like the twentieth might be better. We think it might be a little bit better. It'll give me time to get my Halloween up, and um, and we can. Uh, but let oh, us and I'll have the day off before, so oh, yeah, that would yeah, help yeah. me. That would help me out. So that would be good. So let us know. Yeah, tell us in the comments below. It'd be amazing. We have a couple of people around here that are definitely going to come. Yeah. Kay said she would be coming, and she probably will help us out a little bit. Yeah. And um, we have another friend that said yeah. she might come. Yeah. So we're looking forward to it. I think Jenny would come. And I think Jenny might come. Yeah, our neighbor, that she 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 might come too. So anyway, we're excited. Even if you're not going to cross it, you should come. Because I don't think I can cross it for that amount of time. <laughs> You'll have to film. Yeah, it, I don't know if you and I will get much cross stitching done. That's but true. Anyway, but it's going to be fun. We'd and love to have you. Someone commented that they'd come from California. I yeah. Let us know. But I mean, you don't need to do that. You don't need to do that. No, but no, no, it no, would no. be an honor and privilege. Yeah, yeah. But we'll wait and see how that. Yeah. But anyway, so you guys, that's what we're thinking. Um, and so like one o'clock on Saturday the twentieth. Okay. Correct. Okay. Of October. Of October. October. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. I'm so, sorry, we're back. Yes, yeah, so today's Monday. We had our nephew, my nephew, my grandson's, grandson's birthday. It was his 12th birthday, James. It was his golden birthday. His golden birthday because he turned 12 on the 12th. That is correct. And so um, he had a great, he had a great friend party. He did. And then, um, and then we did a, uh, <laughs> and then we did, um, a family party yesterday. We did. And the, and we need to get him on floss tube and we're going to. Yes, we keep meaning to. He's been doing some macrame. And so we've got to film him. It's yeah. just so hard. Anyway, but he had a great birthday. It was and really then Debbie, fun. We had some family guests over yesterday, so we couldn't film. Yeah, they came. Uh, one of Dave's cousins uh, was just coming by and they live in Colorado. And so we had to visit with them. And then um, I got food poisoning last night. Oh. Kef was not feeling well. It was not a good situation. I'll just tell you that much right now. I never really believed in food poisoning. Uh -huh. I thought it was a fake thing. No. no. I've never... Is, does it mean I'm getting older? No. <laughs> it means you're eating at the wrong place. That's I was. It wasn't yeah. a good... Yeah. It wasn't a good place. When you told me where you'd gone, I was like, oh, wow. Okay. I, we go there at least once a week. Yeah, that's true. But you didn't get what you'd gotten. I didn't. I tried yeah. something new. Yeah. And it was not a good situation at 2 o'clock this morning. <laughs> Until 5 this morning. Oh, that's bad. It was not good. Okay. So I actually just didn't even go to work today. Yep. She was. First, we thought she might have the flu. But then she didn't, so that was. Good. I'm feeling so good now. Yeah, that's good. But yeah. this morning I wanted to jump off a cliff. Yeah, that I was worried about you. But anyway, that's good. So that wasn't good, and then I don't think 
it'll get uploaded until tomorrow. So okay. sorry, everyone. Yeah. So, but we, so we were just a little bit off because of the whole weekend. It's but been anyway. a crazy weekend. Yeah. So anyway, did but, we do anything fun this weekend? Besides well, James' birthday? You you had the, the football game. Mm. They had the football game. Her husband was thrilled. Dave, my husband, was thrilled too. Our, my, like the college that we love, BYU, we won. It was a big deal. It was a big deal. It was a huge deal. So, yeah. And now they're in the top 25. We are. It's kind of, it's been. They better stay that way. Yeah, that's right. It's very. <laughs> Lots of pressure. Lots of pressure, but I feel good about it. Okay. Okay. Just, that was exciting. And then what did we do? Oh, that's actually, maybe you guys will get a kick out of it. Do you think they would? I don't know. <laughs> so Stephen and I went and saw this comedian. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. His name is J.P. Sears. Okay, yeah. They get a kick out of it. Do you think? Yeah, I do. I do. <laughs> so he does, par like, parody videos, would you say? Like, not a Yes, it's like yes, yes. He makes fun of, of you know. Of people. Of, yeah, yeah. And that, certain people, like vegans. Like people would take it, people would be offended. You can't yeah. be in an offense, you have no. a choice to be offended, everyone. Yeah, it, it, he, he, but it's, it's so fun. And like essential oils. Essential oils, which oh. is huge in Utah. Yeah. Is it huge everywhere? Or I just don't know. in Utah? It's probably a big, it must, because they do so well, right? Right. So essential oils, well, he like does he, it. What? He does essential oils. Oh, yeah. So he that, does an essential oils video. It's, and it's basically about just making fun of, like, how it's, like, it's gonna essential cure oils you. cure everything. It will cure everything in your life. It will. Yeah. Like, if you're dying on the side of the road, sprinkle just, some essential oils and you'll be fixed. Yeah. Yeah. And it, we like essential oils. We love, uh, we yeah. have we, essential we, oils. We use We are them. doTERRA fans. Yeah, we, we love them. We but, put them but, in our diffuser. But we know that but there we can is a laugh. limit. Yeah, and we can laugh about it. And there's a limit to their And ability. like for people who are vegans, like you should yeah. be able to laugh too. Although I've only met vegans that really can't laugh at themselves. Uh, Jason, my son and his wife are vegans. Oh, I'd they? say they're vegetarian. They're not full That's vegans. true. They That's true. Eggs. They're not. That's true. They do. They just eat basically no meat meat but they'll eat eggs or yeah yeah but they would laugh at themselves I think maybe I think so anyway I worked with a vegan and it was not ever fun oh really and I'm sorry but you're choosing to be sure, on this diet sure and sure. our company would bring in free food oh yeah and she expected that something was available for her yeah yeah and it was very frustrating. Oh, I'll bet it was. Yeah, that's interesting. I hadn't thought about that. That's funny. Okay. So, in, in my opinion, you're choosing that diet, so. Yeah. So you you went to see him, right? At the oh, yeah. So we cut. went, Stephen and I went and saw him. He came to Utah, and he had six shows, and they were all sold out. We yeah. got our tickets like five months ago. Yeah. And we thought that we were going on Thursday, and Stephen goes to the thing to pick up our tickets. He's like, your tickets aren't until Friday. Yeah, that's right. So that was kind of good because then Debbie and I went to a shower for yeah. my good friend. Yeah, so that was good. And we went and saw him, and it was hilarious. Yeah, you really liked it. I loved it. He's, <laughs> he just has, like, this way he speaks, and it's just so funny. Yeah. So you need to look him up, J.P. Sears, if you need a good laugh. Yeah, because he's on YouTube. He's on YouTube. Yeah, yeah. So that's so. good. Oh, I'm glad you mentioned yeah. that. Okay. All right, so I don't, I think that's it. I was pretty boring. Were you? Yeah. Yeah, I ran errands and did stuff like that, but that was about it. During the week we didn't do anything? No, uh-uh. I keep thinking that it's like 70 degrees outside, and so I wore this cozy oh. sweater, and I hadn't been outside today, and it's like 100 degrees. <laughs> I should go turn the air conditioning so that it's on right now. I can hear it. I can hear it too. Yeah. Okay. So anyway. All right. So we'll do the books and the beauty tip at the end. So that if you don't want to watch those things, we will. And you we're also going to talk it out. We're going to talk. Even though we're sad that you're exiting out. Yeah. We're also going to talk about some planners that we love oh, too. Oh yeah. Okay. All right. So let's talk about stitching. I think it's just me. It's just Debbie. Okay. But you know what? I don't have to go into work two days this week. Okay. So I'm going to be stitching. Oh, that's exciting. And you've got your things now. So yes. You, that's great. That's so exciting. Okay. So you, expect big things that's next right. to you guys. That's right. Okay. Tis the season. I love this. It's really, really it fun. It is so cute. It is really fun. I am... I got, I wanted to do, let's see, it's this way. I got tired of just doing the lighter colors, so I started the cardinal. And I love it. I just wanted to get some some color on there. 
And so I've been doing his body, but I, I the, the his tails at the end. It really is cute. I really like it. I'm really enjoying it. It's a great, it's a fun stitch. Bat but, Bell Swa, ladies. It is lovely. It it's is lovely. Just lovely. And I have to tell you that I'm there are a whole bunch of you that have finished it. I know. What are you guys doing? I don't know, man. They are just fast. It takes me five and a half hours oh. to get like a letter done. I just, I, I can't even, I can't believe it either. But anyway, but that's well, okay. I'm impressed with you. We still have time. I've got plenty of time. I feel like I'll get it done for Christmas. I think you will. Yeah, so I'm excited. This one's big. Yeah, this one is. Welcome um, Foolish Mortals. I got the whole, all of that done. And I started the it face. It looks so good. It's kind of fun. Should we move this? I've got the... Oh, yeah. You have started the face. Yeah. So there we go. It's so cute. It's really... It's a fun It's one. meant to be in my house. I've really got to get going on that. Somebody asked me what this fabric is. And it is 14 count flapper Ada. Ada. Okay. And I got it on one, two, three stitch. I just thought it was perfect. And I got it for you, too, on one, two. So... 14 count flapper Ada fabric. What's the letters on the back? PTP 283Z. P. I don't know. Is that the color? No, no, no. Flapper is the color. Oh, okay. But it is PTP 283Z. If you don't know what it means. Somebody. I should know, but I don't. But anyway, welcome, foolish mortals. There we, we got go. it off of Etsy, right? No, no. One, two, three. Oh, you oh I got this? this off of Etsy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is off of Etsy. Got it. And then I, I had a, I had a hankering, thinking. I'm trying to think of things I can get done. You're by so, the I feel like you're so close. Yeah. So this is come said the wind. Oh, just kidding. Wind. You're not that close. I know. You still I, have a big thing at the bottom. The bottom. I thought it was almost done. But I got a bunch of leaves done, and I didn't want to take it out of the cue snaps, you guys. But I, but I, I, I get. I mean, this is. Oh yeah. Completely, that's completely. Done. I'm impressed. So I've gotten, and I did some on this. So there you go. The I, Prairie Schooler. That anyway, yeah, and I love this one too. I love all of them. So anyway, there you go. Those are what I got stitched this week. I, I should be good very about. proud. Yeah, I feel like I got quite a bit done. So anyway, um, uh, that's the stitching for us this week. We, we have a whole lot of stuff to talk about. We so. do, we do. So should I show them my uh, my wreaths? Okay, all right, you guys. I have wanted to make these wreaths for over a year. Okay. I bet you if you put up a video of just making this wreath, people would go nuts. You guys, this was so fun. But tell them where it's all freaking from. Every single piece is from the dollar store. Okay? It is everything I got. Did you hear that? I got them. I got the dollar store. The frame was from the dollar store. The ribbon uh, deco mesh is from the dollar store. Excuse me, deco mesh. And then the pumpkins and the witches hats all were from the dollar store. I cannot believe that. Isn't it fun? I love them. It's I'm freaking a dollar. I just so well it was more than a dollar. Okay, but I know. This one isn't as full, so I made this one fuller. I made this one for kids. Yeah, but I kind of like that this one has more black. I know. Well, you can have either one that you want. So I've learned a few tips and tricks. But you can make them like that. I mean, they make I swear, up. if you put up a YouTube video that was like, this is all made from the dollar store, people would go gaga. I, it's really, you guys, it's so, How so... How long did it take? Forever? No. Really? Oh, no. An hour? Wow. Maybe two hours altogether after you cut the deco mesh. Okay? They are simple. Simple, simple, simple. I love them. I'm... I'm possessed with it. And you put it on with pipe cleaner. Pipe cleaners. Pipe cleaners. And That's all correct. those were at the dollar store. And those were at the dollar store as well. I can't well. even believe it. Yeah. So I had so much fun. I love these. They're so cute. Yeah. So anyway, those are my reads that I made this week. And I love wow. them. I do. I love them. So I wanted to talk about that. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. And then I wanted to talk to, um, I've had several ladies ask me, I'm going into the books. I've had several ladies ask me about books for boys. Okay. And these are not necessarily uh, second grade boys. Did Matt and Jason like to read? Well, Matt loved Harry Potter. Remember how he yeah, used to read? Like, I mean, Matt read a lot. More than Jason. Really? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. But anyway. I wasn't the reader of the family. No. Debbie, Debbie is disappointed then, in me. But then you started kind of reading. 
The Twilight series. I remember? loved Twilight, and yeah. I loved um, The Hunger Games. Yeah, yeah. But and that came out after, like, I was in high school. Yeah, yeah, that's funny. I was Debbie's disappointment. Oh, oh dear. My reading, dis- your reading disappointment. disappointment. Anyway, um, so I just thought that I would, these are not, you know, um, uh, picture books, but if you wanted to read them to your younger, to the younger boys. Like I, how young? Second grade. Okay. Probably not first. But second grade. So what they are, are historical fiction, okay? So it's based on a real event, but the but the characters are fake. Okay. Okay? And this is Hurricane Katrina in 2005, okay? And I can't keep them in my library for really? the boys. Yeah. And you stole them. Well, I brought them home for the, for the video. So now. Here's I, the bombing of Pearl Harbor. Wow, okay? that's kind of cool. Yeah, and so the kids really, really like it. And if you're trying to get a boy interested, I would say these would be a good, uh, uh, one that you could catch their, their. By catch Lauren Tarshish? Tarshish, Tarshish. Tarshish. Yeah. She is, she's just. She's good. She's good. I survived the destruction of Pompeii, AD 79. Oh my God. Yeah. So, I mean, you know, it's all different. So, it's all true. The San Francisco earthquake, okay? There is the, um, the another one that is good is that there's, there's one about sharks. Um, I survived the shark Jaws? attacks. Oh. No, it's called the shark attacks of something. Oh, and the Titanic. There's oh, a Titanic. I like that yeah, there's one. a Titanic. So, if you have boys and you're trying to help And them, you must know that he survives. Yes, that's right, because I, I survived. survived. <laughs> so if you're trying to hook them, these are kind of some, and I would say you could read them to a second grader, just depending on how scared they get. Some boys don't get scared. Um, some kids don't get scared. But if they, you know, and, and like Hurricane Katrina isn't going to be that scary. But anyway, you could, you could read it to them. But for the older birds, I'd say third grade and up, they should be able and could read these. James loves them. He's loved them. So anyway. That's my book review for this week, okay? That's, I swear I'm allerg- more allergic here than I am in Battle of Four right now. Oh, that's funny. Maybe it's just because I went outside. Oh, true, true. Okay, so that's my book review. I love the book review. Okay, so that's a good one, and people kind of have asked about boys a lot lately. So Got there it. you go, all right? So do you want to do yours now? My Sephora? Yes. Okay, where should I set this? That right, right there. Here. Okay, people. Gather around. Someone mentioned, like, Kev, can we ever see a Sephora haul? Yeah, yeah. And I honestly haven't touched anything because these are just like all restock of what you use. Of all what the time. I use all the time. Okay, all right. So, where do I even begin? Because I love these all so much. That's so great. That's so good. Okay, the most exciting one, and I haven't tried it yet, that I'm most excited about is this shampoo. Oh. And it's expensive, you guys, okay? I get it. <laughs> but it, it smells. It smells like angel wings. It is excellent. The smell is amazing. It's way hair care. And her name is Jen Atkin. She's actually from St. George. Oh, my gosh. But she's, like, she got famous because of the Kardashians, of course. Oh, okay. And she's, like, their hairstylist. Oh, okay, okay. So, you got I got sh- the shampoo, and, like, the bottles are so freaking cute. Hello. And, and they're, and, and, and I got these all 15% off, so don't judge me too harshly. Okay, all right, okay. Okay? So, that's, like, I read one of the reviews online, and someone was, like, it made my hair smell, like, the smell was too powerful. I'm like, there's no such thing as smelling too powerful. No, your hair. No, that's, yeah. Okay. All right. So. Okay. The this next is interesting. One, okay. We're doing this one first. These two things I got at Ulta. They were half off this week. They're eyebrow pencils. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm going to try and open it, but maybe I won't. They're amazing. Here we go. What are they called, Kef? They're Anastasia Beverly Hills. She's known for her... Eyebrows. eyebrows okay and she's i want to say ukrainian okay bulgarian oh her, anastasia i would say ukrainian okay okay um there um, these ones are thicker than she has a brow whiz and a brow definer this is the brow definer and the thing is pretty thick Oh, yeah. The Brow Wiz is like a tiny tiny little pencil so this is if you feel really good about your brows okay so I got it in two different colors. Okay. It's amazing. Okay, all right, okay. But you were gonna tell them about this. This, you guys. You've tried this. It's oh. the freaking best. 
<laughs> mascara I have ever used in my entire life. That's amazing. Ever. Okay. Like, I will never change. Wow. Okay. I heard a review about it. It's, it's called the Hourglass Caution Mascara. And I mean, the packaging is beautiful. It is beautiful. It's so pretty. Um, I'm wearing it right now on my okay. upper and lower eyelashes. Okay. Okay. And it is the most fabulous... So, mascara. I wore it, and I, I'm i very good about taking my makeup she, off at the end of the day. She washes her face every I, night. Religiously. Yes, you do. But I don't remember what happened that night, and I forgot to wash my face. We were super busy. I fell asleep. I woke up the next day, and I kid you not, there was no mascara on my face. And you said not even a flake. Not even a flake. That's crazy. I'm passionate about this. Wow, okay. It is freaking good. And and you said And it's also freaking expensive. Oh, okay. You said your eyelashes were still kind of curled. They too. were curled. I'm not kidding you. It's the most amazing mascara on the freaking planet. This is good. This is good. Okay. All right. And then tell us about you told us about this, but but the Luna stuff. This is the Mira not Mira. This is Sunday Riley Luna Night Oil. It's the bright blue. But it seriously looks bright blue. And you put it on your face. And you put it on your face after you wash your face and you wake up and you look like an angel. Get your I'm just skin. Your skin has been so great too. It's because of that. Are you serious? I swear I don't even use anything else. It's just that. What do you what do you cleanse your face with? Well, it's funny you should ask. Oh. <laughs> This is Murad. I feel like you're the one that introduced me to Murad. I, I do. I had the Murad, you know, that t gets rid of, you know, the little acne. Acne. Yeah, but I don't. I didn't do that. This is the same. It's like, the line, cleanser, but it's okay. the face wash. I, I've never. I use Neutrogena. Murad Acne Control Clarifying Cleanser. And that's what you use. It's amazing. Okay. This. And this will change your life forever. Wow. Maybe I need to get some. I'm just saying. Okay. Final two things. It Cosmetics CC Cream. If you don't like a full coverage foundation. Oh, okay. okay. I love the packaging of it, too. I'm in shade light. Hmm. I bet it would be perfect shade for you, too. Okay. Um, it's really cute. And you don't break out with pump. it. <gasps> and it's amazing. And you don't break out. Oh. Wow. It's life-changing. Okay. This is great. And then I got this because everybody's talking about it, and it's really expensive. It's Dior Face and Body Backstage Foundation. So it's a heavier foundation. Yes. So a lot of people have been mixing, because we're weird, we mix these two together. Okay, okay. So I got that. I haven't even opened this. Huh. It's nothing fancy. Just a, just a, a foundation, okay. But it's Dior. Yeah, okay. That's fancy. Okay, all right. So that is my Sephora slash Ulta haul. Okay, that's very cool. I, Thank you. I can swear by all of those. Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. I may have to invest in some of those. I'm going to give you some to try. Okay. All right. Okay. The uh, last thing that we wanted to talk about that we keep thinking about every week and we forget to talk to you about are our planners. Um, and I'm just realizing that this is my last year's planner, not this year's planner. Oh. Huh. I can't find this year's planner since our Oh, moved. since you moved. And I thought this was it. <laughs> Oh, maybe it's downstairs. Well, I love this. It, I'm sure this was downstairs. So I grabbed it. I'm like, oh, there it is. Oh, oh is okay. Right. All right. Okay. So, but there's stickers in it. So I'm glad I found okay, it. Okay. So tell them about Aaron. You tell them about it. I Aaron. feel like you found it. I did. Aaron Condren. And, and I, we I, love our planners. It's just, you can have anything put on the front of it. Yes. This is my, this was last year's. Yeah. And then this is my this year's. And I Debbie and I it. give it to each other every single Christmas. Yeah, so I get hers and she gets mine. <laughs> uh, this one looked like embroidery. I know, I yeah. loved it. So that's why I, that's why I, this is the bag. And they have like a bazillion covers. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's a million. They have like this, but in white instead of a black background. Yeah, blah, yeah. Blah, 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 Yeah, blah. yeah. And then it just goes January through um, December. And the thing we love the most about it is, well, I love the most. You probably don't love it the most. Tell me. Is the stickers? Yes, I, I know, and I, I, I love the full month. It's a waste of money. I get it. No, no, no. It's so wonderful. It is. Show them that page. Show them the. That. Well, I'm trying. I wondered if I did a whole December. I did. Oh, show them. Oh, that. you did that too. But show them that one from last year. Oh, because this is your. Um, this is my December. Here's what a regular month looks like. Yeah. So see how it doesn't have any stickers on it. 
And then you can go to all these Etsy shops and they have these stickers that you can overlay on top of the, and it's, it's so fun. freaking it's cute. Fun. And I think, oh, oh, I did like eight this year. I did April. So I did April. I did, um, oh, you know what I used? I Look did this one. Oh my heck, I'm obsessed with it. Okay, this, this one. This is what I do during church, is put out stickers like a four-year-old little girl. That is so, okay, this one I used the Oh, that's doodle cute. Bug. So I was excited to be out of school and it was going to be summer, so I used Doodlebug stickers. And I, the, the, the two-page spread for a month is a big deal to me. That's a big deal. Because then I can write things down. Oh, yeah, I Do you agree. know what I mean? So I really like that. And then it Look has. Look at this one. This is the Nutcracker one. And then it has, then it breaks it down. You have week by week. Yeah. So then you can write down your appointments and everything that you need for that week um, as you go through. And it has markers for you to, like these plastic markers that you can move from week to week. So you can I keep your I just love place. it. We, we really enjoy it. It's it's not overly crazy planning. No. Would you say that? It just is It's nice to have. Um, when you're looking ahead, when I'm at school, um, I, I do, I you know, so I plan out the days that we're not going to be there. There's um, another cute one. Yeah. So we really like we our, love them. We like Erin Condren. It's been really fun. Now, with that said. Oh, dear. No, I tried to do this one. Okay, everyone's getting into these. And they're, they're called travel planners. And they're small. So what? why is it, this more exciting? Because they're smaller? They're just more compact. I feel like people like it too because it maybe is a little bit more customizable. It is. You put all of these in here, and mine are all Disney. So mine are all. Which I've is got, so cute. And that, but I, I just, feel like it's too much effort. Like this is like here in my hand. Okay, and the other reason it's nice, like like for this, I can take this out. We will have all of our floss tubes written on here, and then I can that keep is nice. it. So that's nice for 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 to take notes. That's true. This has kind of been nice, but I, I but and I like it. I'll give it's, you that. And I like it because it's Disney. But let me explain. These come out, so they have a month one. It's not any month. Where did you get yours? Etsy. No, I got it from um, Michaels. No, 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 no. I sent away for them. Oh, it's, really? It's um, Echo Park. I want to say it's Echo Park. Is it Echo Park? I follow a lot of planner shops on Etsy and they all have things for this too. Yes, this is echoparkpaper.com because they do this Disney one. Got it. They do lots of them. I should show you all the accounts that I follow. They all have like inserts to put in it. Yes, yeah. They and even go as far as like, see this little string? They teach you how to interchange your strings and you can buy more strings. Oh, wow. Like and they go, they get into Well, it. and then this is kind of a scrapbooky one. So this, see how this is generic? Mm -hmm. So this is the ninth of any month. Then people take this and they, they okay, okay. scrapbook. They might put a picture here. That's cute. And then you it's take like this. a journal. Almost. Yes. And then you can take this out and replace it with a new one for the next month. Got and, it. You know, and, and I've just I'm done, wondering if Erin Condren is going to come out with something like this. I don't know. She'd That'd be, be interesting. silly not to. Yeah. So I've done all of our floss tubes in here, every one of them. And um, I now we'll have that. And then um, they have blank. They have lined. I don't like blank. And the, I and I thought I would like the blank, and I yeah. don't. And then they have the, the months. And then they have like so the dot one. Well, and that's for Echo Park. But the girls that I follow, they do one that's literally almost identical to Erin Condren. Oh, really? But a smaller version. And it has the days like that. And it has days. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay, so this even has a pocket that I could put receipts in. Yeah, so the other girls have like, almost like a page protector. Yeah. I've got to show you, you're gonna die. Is it this, like it. this? No. Oh, okay. And it's like, they stick in die cuts and stuff, and like, oh. I don't know how to explain it, but it's so cute. Huh. I was using the pens, I had the princess pens in here. Oh yeah. Because yeah. it does have a pen holder, that's, that's nice, nice too. But you can get an Erin Condren pen, pen holder. holder. She has a lot of things that you can add on to it. Yeah, she and I, so I like them for different reasons. Yeah, I agree. But we we've used these for years. We've used we love them. Condren for years, and so um, I don't know. It's just a fun thing yeah. to start you guys the year like off planning with. things. And we like to have you know I don't know. Anyway, sometimes you can get them right now for twenty nineteen. I can't believe it's gonna be twenty nineteen. Oh, 
I feel so old. I don't. <laughs> that you can get them for like half off. Really? Because it's like mid month, like in between. An Erin Condren? Yeah, because it would have July oh, of this oh, okay. year. Yeah, yeah, she does through. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so to do July till July of next year, right? Yeah. yeah. So and sometimes so you, you can get them for really cheap. And we have a code for 10% off, or okay. $10 off. Will you link your plan below? And it'll be down below in the description okay. bar. All right, okay. So that's what we know. Okay, that's what we wanted to talk about this week, and we hope that you enjoyed it. Yes. Um, I've watched quite a few floss tubers this week as I've been stitching, and gosh, you guys, there are so many out there. It's I amazing. Know, it is crazy. It's just amazing I to watch I wish we had them. more hours in the day. Yeah. Oh, we the should- party. Should I insert that at the beginning? Probably. Yeah, let's- We're gonna okay. lose people. Okay, let's talk about it. Okay. Okay, Floss Tube. Thank you for watching us again this week. Yes. Um, we are. Uh, it's getting busy. It's starting to it's be that busy. Busy. Started to be that time of year. You know. Our my other nephew was talking about oh. Christmas the entire time that we were at that their we were house. At their house yesterday. Oh and my god. So gosh. now I'm like, do I even put up Halloween? Like, yeah. should I just go straight to Christmas decorations? He was so. He's eight. And he was just, you could see the, the light in his eyes, couldn't you? I and mean, he was showing us. He was is, like looking up on YouTube like, this is showing Santa. They caught him on video. And this is, look, they caught him. And then they caught the elf. And he was just, he was just taken with it. It was the best thing It ever. was darling. It was really, really cute. But now I'm just like, I don't even want Halloween to come. I'm ready for Christmas. <laughs> so anyway. But, so Hence my sweater. Yes, that's right. In yeah. the 100 degree weather. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, so we're, it's getting to be that exciting it time is. of year. So it'll be great. A lot of you are going to a lot of stitch things back in, um, back east. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. There's a bunch of things going on. I'm jealous of that. Have a really good time and think of us. Yes, and, and I think we're going to start changing our music at the beginning. Oh, the first of October. Oh, we're going to go with Everybody Halloween. Everybody loves our music. So we're going to go with Halloween. But we're going to mix it up for the next like three months. Yes. It'll, oh. st it'll stay the same until October. Okay, it'll be so fun though. I know how you guys don't like change, you know. I don't. We can't sit different places. But that'll be fun. That'll be yeah. really fun. Okay, all right. So, you guys, thanks for watching. love you guys. Have a great week. I hope you get a lot of stitching done. Yeah, bye. bye.